them that have been in the business as long as you have come off as being bitter. And you don't seem to have that kind of energy. Uh, and, and so if you can talk to that for a second. I will, I will. First of all, it's very easy to be bitter in this industry because we, get, we, we, we don't get a fair shake. We just don't. But I, again, I've got to say, it's worse for the sisters. It's so much worse for the sisters and so much worse for the females of color. However, the challenge, and Charles Burnett, who knows who Charles Burnett is? A brilliant, brilliant director who, who, who can't get a film made, by the way. He's, he's just too eccentric. He's too, he's too black. <laughs> but Charles said to me, you know what, man, nobody forces me to do this. Nobody's twisting my arm to do this. So even though it is not a meritocracy, America's not a meritocracy. It's not fair. Life is not fair. And you guys will, you, you guys will, will that's going to be part of what you have to deal with. No matter your talents, your gifts, life is not fair. You will not on some level get a fair shake. But guess what? Guess what? Our jobs is to negotiate that. We don't have the luxury of saying, we just, our parents didn't have the luxury, we didn't have the luxury, and you guys won't have the luxury of saying, you know what, life, life ain't fair. I'm taking my marbles, I'm going home. This ain't fair. You don't have that, you don't have that luxury. You gotta figure out a way of negotiating and dealing with it. So. While on the one hand, there's plenty in this industry to make one bitter, <coughs> and on some level, um, no, not on some level, I understand the bitterness. Unfortunately, the bitterness is not usable. You can't use it. You can't use it. So we have to find a way of being proactive. Now, I, I have to say this. I have to say this. I'm bitter. I am. But, but because I understand that I can't use that, I have to find other ways of moving through the world. Because the bitterness is just not usable to me. It's not useful. Um, and I'll tell you a secret. I, I love saying this. After all these years in this industry, I still love acting. <laughs> And that's, that's a victory that I take, you guys, because they have not batted that out of me. I still have that. And I have frustrations. Trust me, just ask my wife, man. <laughs> Who has to live with me. <laughs> oh my God, if I had to hair my hair up. But, but I, I found a way to keep moving, and I've also found a way to maintain my joy of acting. Yeah. Yeah.